all of the videos on this list are scary enough to leave you thankful it wasn't you in any of these bizarre situations caught on camera. Number 12. A rough landing in Buckland, Alaska becomes even scarier when you learn all of the things the pilot said. The fact that anyone is alive is a miracle. They were trying to keep the plane from sharply veering to the right and colliding with everyone below. The plane's steering was off and nobody knew to get out of the way, and it's not like planes have horns or anything, so there was no way to tell them that they were in the way, while everyone on the ground was folding their arms and waiting. The pilot was freaking out and applying a maneuver called asymmetric reverse thrust. Basically, he reversed the engines to change the trajectory of the landing. It cost him a wheel but spared others their lives. So the lesson of this scary video is to assume the worst and give planes plenty of room to land. Situations like this don't always have happy endings. Number 11. A scary video from Albany looks like creepy things are about to happen at night, but when Mike Lice takes the camera to the window, you can see a big problem. It's the middle of the day, possibly the last for him and his family as a terrible change looms in the sky. What happens next haunts them forever. At 9.16, a tree almost connects with the side of their house. The only thing that saved them were winds blowing slightly away from their home. When so much scary stuff happens to you at once, there really is only one reaction. I'm sure they were expecting to capture some scary moments on camera, but nothing like this. Almost losing your home, whether you actually did in the end or not, is one of the scariest things imaginable. Number 10. A strange and mysterious object is found in the woods by a YouTuber named Grant and has his whole group of friends startled by what's inside. Wrapped in tape and caught in the bushes is a creepy red color, faded from being out here so long. They pull at the tape and three minutes later, they are finally ready to reveal the revolting contents inside. Hold on, open it up for a minute, I gotta, I gotta record it. Look at it in there! What is that? Oh, what is that? Oh, no! I don't know! Gray floating chunks rise to the top of the gelatinous pile, an unknown mystery sludge that blows them back with a rotten stench on a windless day. They run away from it more than once. Things get weirder as a frightening conclusion creeps over them. Hey, this is like a somebody's body. We like somebody's body. Huh? I don't know. I'm holding my breath every time I go over there. Okay, it's kind of sketch, bro. Why with duct tape? It's I'm calling on one. Don't call the don't call the emergency one. Someone is leaving this weird thing in the forest, one of the scariest finds of their life, and whoever it is has a lot of duct tape. There is a lake nearby, so I hope it's a fishing cooler full of improperly disposed bait and not what they fear it is. We never get an answer to this unexplained video, so tell me what you think this mystery substance was that made them call 911. Number 9. Here's a fact. In the food service industry, there is a big difference between wrong orders and orders that have gone wrong. This was taken at a fast food restaurant in Oklahoma, and let me tell you something. 
I doubt this is the first time this little guy and all of his friends have ever gone scampering across all of the buns. And if it's happened to one location, chances are it's happened to many. This leaked video was posted by an employee after the manager acted like this was not a big deal. I commend her for probably losing her job to make sure none of us were served this food. With that said, there's still way too many people who were served a mouse bun before anyone noticed. Number 8 some rather unexplained paranormal activity was caught on video when a ghost hunter by the name of Tracy puts their camera on the floor of a haunted house. One of the many haunted places in an unnamed ghost town they're exploring all alone. Soon, strange noises are heard as a shadow figure slowly plays against the wall. This might be an actual shadow figure, or someone walking across the window to create the appearance of one. The noises make sound like they could be special effects played from a speaker. Number 7. A door closing by itself is another classic sign of a ghost haunting the place. And it doesn't always have to be a ghost slamming the door. A gentle closing is oftentimes twice as scary. If you're out there, please shut this door one more time. That's all I'm asking. Just me. Oh my. Okay, I'm. I'm getting seriously freaked out right now. The person who captured the paranormal activity says they were home alone when the door shut by itself a few times. I don't believe that just happened. I didn't think I'd get anything. Well, I'm definitely going to be filming this area more. He says a ghost slammed it shut in the past, but this time it shut it gently. Afterwards, he investigates the door to show us there is nobody standing on the other side because there is no room. It's apparently a haunted staircase, presumably leading to the attic. He says there are no open windows behind him, which was my guess. At one minute, you can see no string around the interior knob, which was my other guess. Freaky, right? Number 6. Spirits seem to love to announce their presence by turning the lights on and off. Before we had flashlights, it was oil lanterns and candles. The scary phenomenon continues in a haunted house in South Wales when a spirit is told to show a sign. Startled, they investigate the incident by asking the ghost to communicate through this light. It's hard to tell from this creepy video if the flickering is a faulty wire or paranormal activity. A strange grin across his face at 1 minute and 47 seconds is a difficult response to read. A scared and nervous reaction is probably it. He's really being brave. Only a true ghost hunter can smile through their fear. Number 5. A lot of scary ghost sightings involve a doorway or a window. They always seem to be haunting a passageway leading into the house. At 31 seconds, a pale apparition leans in to peek through the doorway of this building. Then the mysterious figure is gone, disappeared. I couldn't find anything to explain what was moving in the door. The ghost hunter later explains, after doing some more research, he says this haunted place is home to voices of children laughing and playing, stories that further creep him out. This building was a funeral home before the haunted place was abandoned. The cameraman is too scared to get near the haunted place, let alone go exploring, but a possible long distance ghost sighting leaves him freaked out. I agree, there is something in the doorway. Whether it's a ghost or not is hard to say from here, but something is there and that's pretty weird. Number 4. I know. Look. 
That's actually so creepy, dude. There's a guy right there, and I'm kind of freaked out, not gonna lie. Blake Gray fears he's captured something that would terrify all of us behind the dumpster of an abandoned building while exploring. His brave friend slowly creeps up. So obviously this was a skit that was pre-planned, right? Wrong. Let's analyze what they were wearing on the day they captured this mysterious figure. Ripped jeans, skinny jeans, blue jean shorts. The mysterious stranger is wearing khakis. So yeah, this creepy event is scary and most importantly could be real. The person is still alive, but to what degree is unknown. A twitch of the leg could mean asleep or barely alive. If this is real, then I hope they notified the proper authorities to come make sure whoever this is is still alive. Number 3. Two men have a scared reaction at what's captured on surveillance video. <laughs> A tall figure approaches the gate. The gate does not open by itself, but the mysterious figure, the ghost of a man, appears to go through it. Shaken by fear, the two try to explain what's been caught on camera. They both seem to know a ghost sighting in real life is the only real answer. Getting scared is definitely the right reaction upon seeing something like this on video. Now all that's left to do is run away screaming. Number 2. This is said to be a real ghost video from Singapore. A woman jogs down the road when she has a creepy encounter with a stranger who may or may not be paranormal. She doesn't hear any footsteps until he is running away. It's like he was never behind, and when she looks to where he just was, he's gone. Then he passes again and things get even scarier. <laughs> You could pass somebody twice like this if you ran a wide loop around them. But why he would do this and scare her is something I doubt we could ever explain. I don't think this is paranormal, but I do think acting this way is not normal. I think it's most likely a short film, but there are no credits, and it presents itself as a real ghost video caught on camera in the description. I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. A man believes the stairwell in his apartment is haunted by a creature that's not paranormal, but not human. He thinks he sees movement and says this is a still image. The image has gone viral, so I wanted to analyze the video. The video does not look nearly as convincing as the image, which is often the case because it is harder to animate than Photoshop. The figure shows a convincing lack of realistic movement as it dips back into the darkened doorway from where it came. So if you've ever seen this popular picture and were wondering what the accompanying video looked like, now you know. From scary deep sea creatures to bizarre beach sinkholes caught on camera, finding creepy things in the sand or underwater is more common than you think and more terrifying than you could ever imagine.